Listen. I'm in front of uh, the courtroom, City Hall, right now. Totally vandalized. This is like... This is like the courtroom right here in downtown. And it was totally vandalized back there. And then up here, there's some more vandalizing that someone did on the walls right up there. Morning, it's May 31st, 2020, and I'm filming some of the aftermath from those uh, George Floyd riots we had in downtown Portland last night and the night before. So first of all, right outside the precinct downtown, you can see that it's all closed off there. And across from this building too, I don't know how well you can see, but there's a fence on the other side. We're like right downtown in downtown Portland right now. If you didn't hear how crazy those riots were these last couple of nights, they were super, super, super crazy. So I think that riots in general could be avoided if people know how to communicate with each other about their feelings and their frustrations. Anyway, don't mind me. And all around us, there's so much vandalism and so much trash spewed all around the city. And it's really fucking unfortunate because Portland is like a ghost town right now. And it seems like no one really lives here. You know, they just, I mean, look at this, man. I'm crossing third and main right now. And there's a bunch of like trash and shit and, you know, like stuff, just debris in the street piles of clothes, sleeping bags, and shit, and it is not quite the Portland that I like, you know, but people at riots just threw the shit everywhere, all cattywampus, I mean, I heard there were dumpster fires, I heard there were lots of vandalizations and broken glass and shit, so it's pretty, pretty bad, and you guys can even see so much shit is vandalized. It looks like someone wrote my sign on this fucking building. That's my sign. It wasn't me, I promise. And you got the nice classical music coming from the 7-Eleven across the street amongst all the vandalism and chaos and rebellion and craziness that happened last night. Portland is honestly, unfortunately, like a ghost town these days just made it to Pioneer Square and everything around us is fucked. Even the, uh, what's that? Somebody had a good morning. Yeah, holy fuck, man. Dude, it's crazy. I, I came down here just to fucking video it, throw it on my Facebook. My Dude, screen. honestly, same. Honestly, same. Like, I'm gonna, Dude. holy shit, man. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna make this into a video. I'm gonna be like, look at all this fucking vandalism that happened last night. The Apple Store, man. The Apple Dude, Store is boarded off. off. Pioneer Place is fucking bordered off too, man. It's crazy shit. Holy crap. Wow. Damn. So clearly I'm not the only guy out here just filming around all the fucking wreckage in downtown. This is the Apple Store. The Apple Store. I heard that the windows got, like, bashed in. So that's why there's all this, like, plywood and a bunch of graffiti on it because people need to learn how to be people and communicate with each other.